Terry Gamagami and Rebecca Mattingly were arrested right here on Highway 77 around 11:30 this morning after about a 15-minute pursuit. Officials were able to stop Gamagami's car right here. Gamagami then took off on foot through that field where he was arrested a short time later. Whenever they was took off running, that's about the only time I knew he was on our own. Corey Hauser works at Highway 77 Auto Repair. Right across the field, Gamagami was running through before he was detained. Guy went all running across the pasture, that's about it. Hauser says he wasn't worried about Gamagami making it to the shop. No. You gotta get past the fence, I can't get over the fence. Court records show Gamagami pleaded guilty in Love County Court this morning on 2015 charges for eluding police and assault and battery with a dangerous weapon. Facing several more charges in other counties, Officials say Gamagami grabbed his wife, Rebecca Mattingly, and ran out of the courtroom, jumped in this truck, and took off. Through Marietta westbound on Highway 32, a couple of miles outside of town, and then he made a U-turn, came back eastbound on Highway 32, then north on I-35. And uh, the whole time we were able to box him in and keep him at a controlled speed. Officials tried unsuccessfully to shoot out Gamagami's tires. Love County Deputy Cody Blagg says Gamagami made his way onto Highway 77, where the Oklahoma Highway Patrol was waiting for him with stop sticks, blowing out Gamagami's back left tire. Watch as the trooper forces Gamagami's car into a spin and then into a ditch. But Gamagami wasn't done yet. He then took off running through the field, but was quickly caught. He was going from speeds anywhere from 50 to, to 100 miles an hour. Mattingly won't face charges. Blagg says she wanted out of the car the entire time. I could see the expressions on her face. She was scared. I figured they'd be hurt, but they weren't. In Carter County, Amy Jensen, News 12.